Alright, hi guys, and today is the first day of the lock boxes chances we have. So, actually, if you go to collections, you're gonna see that there are some duck in a box lock boxes. We can open them on Christmas, and you will unlock. I'm gonna show now this champion. And so basically, you can gain these lock boxes by doing the daily mission every day. So there we have two new heroes. So the first one, Colleen Wing. She's a generalist, she has two passives. The first one, Way of the Samurai. She protects allies who have less than 60% health from single target or area attacks, has a chance to block attacks, take and reduce damage. Then the other one passive, chance to perform a follow up attack after attacking, after performing single target attacks. After follow up attack, the buffs are removed and get health is gained. Wow, that's cool. So her actions, yeah they are all one enemy. So the first ability, open wound, chance to play ravage at end up to three application of bleeding, bleeding and pressure points. Then you have made to massacre, that is actually all enemies, I didn't see that. It's stealthy, hemorrhaging attack, it removes buffs and applies weak point. Nice. Level 6. Applies tender eyes, wide open, and on herself, samurai spirit. So she has a chance to interrupt incoming enemy attacks and counter attacks. Also, both. So this is actually like a combo breaker plus um, an interrupting attack. So this is cool. Then her level 9, the big hit. Brutal Strike, the other crates, Exposed Bleeds, and Paragon Exploder. So all her of her abilities are slashing. So yeah. Right, so the lockbox hero we're gonna see now is this cool Howard the Duck. It's a tactician. He has two passives. The first one. He gains grit when attacked and has a chance to grant an extra turn when attacked. Okay, so the second passive is really good. So, chance to grant an extra turn when attacked. He's unfortunate he's a tactician, but yeah. So, and then he has private high. It's the same of uh, Jessica Jones. So, he applies target focus and has a chance to gain further intel. First ability. Eat my glove. I've made you a knuckle sandwich. <laughs> Alright, so he's one enemy. Uh, true grit, so more damage, and then knockout punch stuns targets that have combo breaker. They have combo setup. Combo setup. Yeah, there the, he is. The combo setup. Actually, his level 2 is a multi action. Wow, has 4 actions. So, the first one, one enemy. Ignore defense, does damage, and then applies on all allies, one for all. So, attacks have a chance to cause allies to join in, single target attacks, and all for one. Allies have a chance to retal retaliate when an ally is hit by single target attacks. So, actually, this, like, a mental coordination plus a, uh, a like the retaliation buff from the sentinels so it's really good second ability second like of the multi action the second ability is quick action summon attack and puts flanked and cornered Alright, so 
the f sad thing about s about someone attack is that it doesn't uh, is subtle so an agent that protects will protect from this quick action so this is sad then another quick action that is called neurotribe is the same as the neurotrope but is an ability on a champion so uh, random beneficial effects combat awareness and epiphany to all allies and then the last one desperation attack paragon explorer stealthy this one is stealthy and applies open wound so like a lot of abilities then quack fu pressure points combo setup incapacitation on one enemy and then the last one is actually a free action cooldown of two rounds so you can use it one round then you wait one round and then the other round you can use it again and feeling ducky lasts three rounds so you can actually use it like have always this one unless the enemy removes it and puts on himself feeling ducky so chance to evade attacks counter enemy attacks follow up after all ally attacks and ignore enemy defense when attacking gains grit and a small amount of stamina when the bob triggers so this is like uh, the the ISO you get from not the ISO the passive of domino so get lucky touching attacks, covering, following up, ignoring it's like I get lucky but on a free action wow so these are the two characters then I'm gonna show that the first mission is here you have to complete it and you can gain five lock boxes dark lock boxes and there is this one it's actually you gain 20 lock boxes and you have to use five duck these tinnies that are found in combat okay so that's it for the news I think the two new heroes and actually farming for the components in spec ops I have 14 now so I'm trying in these last two days to take as many components as I can but I have few unstabilized weight to do that but I'm gonna try to at least get like 18 19 so I can spend 15 gold and get the super weapon and we can wreck people in PvP so that's all for me hope you enjoyed and see ya